All right, guys, so we just liquefied our skull. We're going to do the same thing to our neck. So down here underneath your gradient, you should have your neck layer. Go ahead and bring that back and just place it directly under this face. It says face copy. I'm going to change that just back to face. That copy bothers me. Now, what you're going to notice is our face no longer really connects into our neck. But that's okay, we're going to fix that. So the first thing we want to do is we're going to right click on our neck mask and we're going to apply it. So that is now going to totally decapitate you permanently. You will see no more face there, just neck and shoulders. We are going to use the liquify tool to A, help fill in this gap here, and B, shrink your neck and make it look kind of crazy. So I guess actually instead of liquify, let's use the warp tool on this. This will be fun. So I'm going to come up to edit, transform and warp. That little mesh grid is now going to be on my neck. And I am going to start lifting up these little arms right here. And you're going to see my neck going back up into my skull. That's what we want. I can hit enter to keep it. And if I hide my face, you'll see it did kind of stretch all of that back up in there to help fill in that place. Now I'm going to hit enter again. I'm going to come back into my warp. And I'm just going to kind of just lift my skin up a tiny bit. I'm not going like this because that looks horrible. But I just kind of raised my skin up just a little bit more just to kind of give me a little more wiggle room. So now I know my face is going to sit under there. Now I'm going to come back in here into liquify. Be sure and use this one. Don't use that one. It's just going to read you did what you did to your face. And I'm going to get me a big old brush and I'm just going to kind of shove in my neck a little bit. I want my neck to be kind of skinnier than it originally would have been on my actual character here because that's just going to make my face look even crazier. Now don't give yourself like a pencil neck, like that doesn't look good. Be responsible with your liquefying. And just that little bit of shrinkage and elongating my neck here helps my head kind of stand off of this peg of a neck that we have. All right, our next video, we are going to start doing some shading and highlighting to help bring out some of our facial features.